all it is Jules and welcome to another video this is a review video for these four books which you guys just saw in a lovely beginning and I'm still at the beach so I hope you guys enjoyed the beginning and I'll tell you guys all about these books which I gave them all four stars they're awesome and all that but I'll tell you guys some more when I actually get back to my place and all that because the bugs out here are starting to come out. It is after 9 at night. So yeah. So I'll see you guys soon. Bye. See you shortly. Hey y'all. This is Jules. And welcome to the other part of this video. It's actually hours later. It's actually 6 p.m. now. Or just about. Um, we'll get to these books, lovely books here, the beautiful ones, in just a second. I hope you guys enjoyed the beginning of this lovely video of when I took these lovely books to the beach and everything. Um, I really enjoyed doing that. That was, uh, awesome and fun. So, we're going to go ahead and jump into this. Uh, review part of this video for each of these lovely books. We have Fire and Ice. Into the Storm. Sorry about that. My phone was going off. Neptune's Trident. The sighting. And I'll grab the, them back in a second. They're all by Julie Gilbert. And the series, I believe, is called The Dark Waters, A Mermaid Journey. A Mermaid's Journey. It says so on the bottom. So, we'll now go ahead and tell, and this first book, you get introduced to India Finch and she finds out she's half mer and she does not know on why and she finds out more about her family history and everything and she is currently staying with her grandpa on an island I forget the name of the island and Pretty much that what happened in this lovely first book, pretty much. In this lovely book, book two, in this one, things happen. It gets more um, wild and crazy in this one. As you can tell with the cover, some things happen not in the best way. She's learned more how to use her special abilities to help the mer. And, um, she's part of Ice Canyon with her friends. You meet her friends. Um, you get to know her friends more in this book, which is Lulu, Nari, and Diana. And even a little bit about Evan. And all, her and her friends are part of the Ice Canyon, Mer, and then Evan is part of the Fire Canyon, her cannon want to kill humans. Her cannon does not. They want to have them be able to all live in peace. So that's pretty much what goes on in this one. Um, trying to survive, um, survive and figure something out. Um, so everybody's at peace. In a way. So this is like the start of all the chaos. Is pretty much how I'm going to say it. And now we got book three. Um, Neptune's Trident. They. India Finch and her friends end up going on a journey. Alone. And they try to find the Neptune's Trident. Things go 
go crazy and yeah that's pretty much the best way I could put it without giving it away and it gets kind of creepy a, a little bit too so definitely interesting then we have the sighting the last book in this series um the I can't say much about this book because it's the last book a lot happens by the already this point and I love the ending in this and also there's a lot of life lessons she's learned by this point that's pretty much all I can really say because I don't want to give it away because so much happens in these books these books are 160 pages each and that's it they're as you can tell they're really small books so but gorgeous um I'm trying to think if anything else I can say without spoiling it um Evan I can definitely say this part Evan is actually her crush I can say that because you guys kind of already know that within the first two books so yeah um that's pretty much it I can't really tell more because it would give it away I gave all these lovely books four stars four stars um I enjoyed them they were so adorable I even learned some stuff out of them I gave them all four stars they're amazing books for middle grade I think they'd be considered in but I'm not sure on that um, the series again is I believe called Dark Waters A Mermaid's Journey and we have book one book two book three book four and they're all by Julie Gilbert Can I show you the first? I don't know if you can see the name. There we go. Um, so, yeah, I really enjoyed them. And I really enjoyed going to the beach and taking pictures of these by the water. Last night, it was beautiful. The water was so calm. It was gorgeous. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing that and everything. I hope you guys enjoyed this whole video. That is it for this lovely, relaxing review of these mermaid books. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.